Greetings, Mayor, Mayor Pro Tem, members of the City Council, and members of the public. This is Brenda Lopez. I am the Housing Programs Manager for the Oxnard Housing Authority. This item is regarding the Oxnard Housing Authority's five-year agency plan and annual plan. The recommendation is that the City Council hold a public hearing to receive comments concerning the proposed plans and also adopts a resolution approving the proposed plans. To give you a little bit of background, the five-year and annual agency plan is a document submitted to the Department of Housing and Urban Development, also known as HUD. It provides a description of the agency's regulations, requirements, and operational program policies. All public housing agencies are required to adopt and update their annual agency plan in order to comply with federal regulation 24 CFR Part 903. In addition to describing our policies, the plan includes an application for capital fund grants. This grant provides the necessary funding for the agency to undertake major capital improvements of its public housing units. And the plan is due at least 75 days prior to the beginning of the fiscal year. This year, our submission is due to HUD by April 17th, 2021. On January 18th, 2021, a draft of the proposed agency plan was posted for the required 45 day public comment and review period, which closed on March 5th, 2021. In addition, a resident advisory board RAB meeting was held to go over the proposed plans. The RAB board is made up of public housing residents and Section 8 program participants. This fiscal year, no significant changes were proposed to the Housing Choice Voucher, or otherwise known as Section 8 Administrative Plan, nor to the Admissions and Continued Occupancy Policy Plan, which is a plan that governs our public housing program. No written comments from the public were received. Lastly, as mentioned earlier, a component of the plan is the Capital Fund Grant, which provides funding for the preservation and to maintain integrity of the Oxnard Housing Authority's public housing stock and to fund any necessary improvements. In addition uh, to capital improvements, a portion of the budget is allocated towards debt repayment, administrative maintenance, a and &E, and operational costs. The fiscal year 2021 grant amount being requested is $1,524,272. Once again, the resolution approves the capital fund five-year action plan, the 2021 annual agency plan, the five-year PHA plan, and the 2021 capital fund budget. This concludes my presentation. Our housing director, Emilio Ramirez, will be available to answer any questions or additional information needed. Thank you for your time.